What is up, YouTube? It's Ubu, the tech guru, coming straight at you. This is another video showing the issues that still remain in the Crisis 3 multiplayer. You're going to notice in the lower left corner, I know it's you can't really read it, but uh, I can assure you that it does say patch underscore B underscore 1. So that's the latest um, like hotfix patch, I guess you want you could call it. It's, it's like a behind-the-scenes update, and it's automatically downloaded when entering the multiplayer. It's a little bit different than, a, than, a, than like a downloadable patch, um, but the Crisis did release a downloadable patch yesterday as well. Uh, that's patch 1.1. So, like, when you fire up the game, it's going to say, you know, notice uh, there's an update for the game, you know, and it shows it through your Xbox dashboard. Um, so... You know, basically, the game is completely updated to patch 1.1 as well as hotfix patch uh, B underscore 1. And I'm still having connection to connection to Crisis 3 server errors. I'm still getting game freezing. You know, I'm still getting uh, game freezing during party chat. Um, it's just, it's unacceptable, Crisis. Come on now, seriously. You know, I wanted to do a face cam to, you know, just kind of have it mean something you know I'm putting some effort into my video here to you know a plea to you guys you know we you guys had an open beta and provided tons of testing for whatever the from the 29th to the 12th you know these types of issues should not be still here you know I mean the the, the patch for 1.1 specifically stated you know that it was going to fix um, squads joining and disconnecting from servers. Well, I have patch 1.1, and you know you're going to see in this gameplay I have here in the background on Williamsburg that you know I end up losing connection to servers, but to the Crisis 3 servers. Um, you know it, it could be possibly because I believe I was chosen as host in this game, which I don't know why. I really don't have. The connection to support, you know, 12 players on this on any map in Crisis 3. I only have 0.5 megabit upload, so I don't know if you need to change your netcode so that it's maybe a little more strict on who it chooses for host, and that might solve these these you know connection to server being lost issues. Uh, I mean, it's just it's absurd, Crisis, you know, and and it's it's making the game broken, you know, if you continually lose connection to the crisis 3 servers or you you lose connection to the host you know and it kicks me back out it just it disrupts my enjoyment of the game it disrupts my gaming session you know and and sure people are going to say oh it's only a game like big deal you know just restart the game back up well well sure it's only a game but the game is supposed to be enjoyable it's supposed to be fun and it's not fun when you're playing a game and you're doing really well, you know, I was actually doing pretty good in this match. I think I was like 15 and 3 or, I don't know, I was doing well, I thought. I got an orbital strike, which is, uh, you know, a 5 kill streak. Uh, you know, and you're going to see here in a moment that the game just decides to completely go kaput. Right in the middle of while I'm playing. Um, you know, I've gotten a couple double kills, a couple triple kills, a couple max radars. Um, you know, and there you go, boom, just completely gone. The game decides, you know, Ubu, we're not going to let you play anymore. We're just going to drop our connection to you, and you're done playing. So right there, attention, your connection to the Crisis 3 server has been lost or cannot be established. You are being returned to the main menu. And that, that is just bogus, Crisis. I'm sorry. You know, you specifically release a patch, you know, 1.1, and state that it contains bug fixes and updates, and one of and the fourth one down fixes for squad joining and disconnecting from servers so you did not fix it crisis and here is another game I want to show and just notice in the lower left corner that it does say patch underscore B underscore one um, you know I'm gonna uh, this is a crash site game on the map Hell's Kitchen um, anybody else watching this this is the visor you activate it by hitting up on the left d-pad um, up on the d-pad and you just look at an enemy and notice how it tags them. So they went into the, 
they went into the crash site being tagged, which kind of, it could, you know, it helped my team know where they were, but the, the, for some reason the enemy still ended up getting the upper hand on them. But I um, just wanted to throw in that quick little tip about tagging in the game. You know, if you're not if you're not a beast on the sticks and, you know, you don't win gunfights 100% of the time, sometimes just sit back cloaked and use your visor and tag your tag the enemies for your teammates. The, you know, when you tag them, I believe they remain tagged. They, they glow bright red and um, shows their, you know, their enemy gamer tag over their head. Um, it, it, I believe it does that until they end up dying. <laughs> So here I try to do some more tagging, end up getting one tag, <clears throat> and um, I don't know, Crisis, uh, you know, I'm, I'm like, <laughs> you know, you release a patch for the Typhoon, uh, which was in the data patch B underscore one, and, uh, you know, you reduce the melee while sliding to match the uh, melee damage that were reduced in patch A, you reduce the mid-range damage for the Typhoon, you know, you fixed all these other issues, but not the main issue, in my opinion. Excuse me, in my opinion. You know, connection to host, connection to the Crisis 3 servers, that is like first and foremost. Come on, get your netcode corrected so that I can enjoy the game. You know, don't worry about bal gun balance issues and other issues of that nature when, when I can't even, you know, enjoy playing the game th completely through to begin with that's just that's like basics come on crisis you know I, i'll try to i'm trying to provide constructive criticism for your game i'm trying to enjoy the game i'm trying to get people to purchase the game but it's hard for me to do that when your game is broken you know the connection issues are severe um so please crisis you know get the get a new patch out and fix this net code for connection to servers losses and game freezing you're gonna see right here in a second you know I'm playing the game having fun and just boom right out of nowhere game frozen that is completely unacceptable for a multiplayer game the game should not freeze while I'm playing it you know and it's not an Xbox issue I have a newer elite Xbox 250 gig hard drive so please crisis this is ubu begging you fix your broken game Thank you for listening, everyone. I tried it to be constructive as possible, and that's about all I got. Until next time, I will see you on the battlefield. Ubu out.